अल्ट्रा बोले तो इट्स लाइक अल्ट्रा है भाई अल्ट्रा है आई नो योर पासवर्ड नाउ कोई और ज़ूम इन करके इधर हैक कर दिया तो कोड की ब्रो 14 चैट वाज लाइक 13 चैट होते देयर वाज नथिंग न्यू अबाउट इट Like we tested otherwise, but to test it on camera is a whole different story. Oh my God, it's gonna take ten minutes again. Like, do we have patience to like sit and record footage for like one hour? So it brings me immense pleasure to actually show you Ultra Nine Two Eight Five K. And we are one of the very few fortunate people in India, who have this launch before. One of the only. We are the only. Oh yeah, we are the only, bro. We are the only. We've built and tested six different systems with similar configurations, but all on Ultra Nine with different graphic cards. It's been fun. So when we started this business, we never thought that Intel will say, "Our launch is coming. Please, have you test it? It's such a big deal, right? I mean, you never think that this will happen to you when when you're that single guy, two guys starting a company. That as a day, I'm going to. So here we are testing out Ultra Nine Two Eight Five K. very much before launch you probably see this when the embargo lifts so yeah thank you intel and with that out of the door so what's the new over ultra 9285k many people will say not much and many people will say a lot i mean already is ke intel ke slides on the 10th of october a lot of influencers made videos about it about how it's stacking up or what's the lithography what's the boost clock sab kuch chiplet design type ho gaya hai abhi all of that's already been said so let's boil it down what's actually new the naming for one the naming is completely different now instead of core i we are like ultra 9 ultra 5 and so on that's one thing another thing is if you notice in all the benchmarks and all the press material that you see there is one interesting spec that's being repeated again it's ai tops tops for those who don't know is trillion operations per second so yeah everyone's talking about ai so why should intel be behind so the new 15 gen is all about performance per watt how do we get the same level of performance as 14 gen or slightly above but at a lower power draw in some cases much lower power draw and of course with lower power draw comes lower temperature and also another focus with like with every other manufacturer anything to do with electronics is ai ai tops measure ho raha hai abhi and probably that will be kind of a performance target when the next gen version launches right and finally what is the next focus about this launch it's stability like with 13th and 14th gen having a lot of negative press to the point where i think i think intel was slightly worried about it so stability is a big factor in this launch so zara gyan mein nahi deta hu we thought we'll run benchmarks but we wanted to do it slightly differently maybe run a few benchmarks on cam so let's turn around and i haven't seen this before and we'll see your cinebench so cinebench multi core is right there 2184 84 it's better than probably anything you can buy before this 9950x it's better than 4900k yeah ever so slightly but yeah 9950x is like 2033 so it's like 100 points more let's straight away run single core सिंगल कोर चलवा देते हैं हम लोग ओ माय गॉड इट्स गोना टेक 10 मिनट्स अगेन नो वन थिंग यू कैन एक्चुअली शो व्हाइल दिस इज रनिंग इज व्हाट द टेंपरेचर्स आर गोइंग टू या या सो इफ यू ज़ूम इन आई डोंट नो इफ यू कैन ज्यादा नहीं है भाई लेट्स गो टू द इंडिविजुअल कोर एंड चेक या टेंपरेचर्स आर लाइक नॉट नॉट हाई एट ऑल द 86 डिग्रीज वाज व्हेन एवरीथिंग वाज वर्किंग इन द मल्टी कोर टेस्ट एंड इन द सिंगल कोर टेस्ट यू कैन जस्ट सी इट्स जस्ट 55 degrees. It does have a 360 mm AIO, but pretty chill, right? Maximum voltage no, no, no. 236. Oh yeah, that too, right? उससे ज़्यादा गया ही नहीं है मतलब हमारा भाई. Yeah, 236 maximum. Crazy, no? 14900 K is 380, so that's clearly 40 percent. Two thousand years later. It's still lower. It's closer to 136 versus 139. परसेंटेज वाइज देखेगा तो हार्डली दो परसेंट एनी वेज सो ऑल दर टेस्ट शुड लाइक डू यू हैव पेशेंस टू लाइक सिट एंड रिकॉर्ड फुटेज फॉर लाइक वन आवर वी टेस्टेड अदरवाइज बट टू टेस्ट ऑन कैमरा इज अ होल डिफरेंट स्टोरी इट्स नॉट ईजी दिस इज द फर्स्ट टाइम यूर रनिंग आर डी आर टू ऑन दिस 
I'm not playing the game. Later that same evening. So that was that. All the benchmarks for all the games that we tested and everything else that we tested in terms of software is on your screen. You can see it's a decent kind of an upgrade from 4900K. But the real question is, should you be buying this? Now the answer is kind of two part. If you already have a 4900K, maybe not. Maybe you don't need to do that upgrade because apart from having a heavier power bill, you can have similar performance. But if you're buying a new PC altogether and you have that kind of budget, you definitely should take an Ultra 9285K. It's not that expensive. The pricing is in line with all the previous generations, works at a much lower power draw. So yeah, electricity is much rare. And of course, gaming is hey, multi-core is hey. So I, I guess this is one of the best desktop presses to get right now. It's not too far to say that. So can't wait to see what AMD comes up with. Oh, yeah. So that is us signing off. I hope you liked our different take on trying to do a review video. Because I mean, all, all review videos tend to get boring, right? Like, benchmark, put this is very good, that's not good. Great job. I mean, yeah, we just wanted to do it differently. Hope you enjoyed watching this. Let us know if you'd like to see unhinged reviews like this. And yeah, if you're in the market or if you need a high performance system for any of your use cases, you know who to get in touch with. We have four stores across the country and we ship nationally through our website. Thank you for watching.